Hi, my name is Delaney Plant and I'm a senior at Sprague High School. This year I get to be a part of the Mr. and Miss Olympian pageant at Sprague. Each year, 12 seniors raise money for Dornbecker Children's Hospital throughout the school year. Last October, I got to meet with the amazing Liam and his family. Liam is a nine-year-old brain cancer survivor and patient at Dornbecker Children's Hospital. Liam and his family inspired me with their courage and their faith during such a hard time. Here's a video that I made with Liam when I got to visit with him. I just wanna be okay, be okay, be okay. I just wanna be okay today. I just wanna be okay, be okay, be okay. I just wanna be okay today. And what did I say, Liam? Who could donate money to a hospital? Anyone. Anyone can donate money to a hospital. So Liam went upstairs and got his piggy bank and brought his piggy bank downstairs and counted out six dollars and he wanted to give six dollars because he was six years old and that's um where his club started i just want to feel the day feel the day feel the day i just want to feel something today i just want to feel the day feel the day feel the day i just want to feel something There's a young boy with a brain tumor. Like if he had to get an IV, what would you say to a little boy who was, because I know that for you the toughest part Blow bubbles. Was, was getting an IV. That's how I did it. Blow bubbles and he brain. We're so grateful for people who have gone before us and have been so generous with their donations. Be, and because of those donations, you know, that have helped with research and, and, and other things, we have a perfectly healthy son sitting next to me. Everybody can do something. And in Liam's case, the most he could do was $6. And his $6 has blossomed into about $65,000 to date. And it's just really exciting to see a small donation duplicated thousands of times. And that $65,000 has, has helped um, Dr. Selden, um, he's the chair of the pediatric neurology department, with uh, some really um, amazing projects. And so, I just, just do what you can. If it's $6, do $6. If it can be more than $6, mm -hmm. do that. We, we we mention this all the time. We we think of Dornbeckers now, and we we remember good times, the laughter, the the uh, you know just the, yeah, the friendships we, the friendships we made with the nurses and the staff. We remember that a lot more than we do remember the painful parts, which is we find that very interesting. For us, Dornbecker gave us our son back. For the Oli pageant, we have to raise as much money as we can for Doran Becker during the school year. Usually these fundraisers take place just at my school, but with this campaign I felt that we could reach out to a much larger audience than just my high school. Partnering with several businesses in Salem, we have created merchandise to go along with the BOK okay campaign. You can purchase t-shirts like the one I'm wearing, as well as it in black too. <laughs> There's also, we also have car window decals that are, these removable car window decals that have the logo on them as well. The, um, the amazing Fig Jewelers in Salem has designed several necklaces that you can purchase that have the BOK logo on them as well. Thank you so much for watching and taking time to donate money to Doran Becker Children's Hospital. There will be links in the description box below with ways to contact me about ordering t-shirts, jewelry, or car stickers. If you have any other questions or want to find other ways to donate money to Doran Becker Children's Hospital, just look in the box below this video and you can find lots of ways to contact me as well as to get involved with raising money for Doran Becker Children's Hospital. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you're all, you will, I hope you will all be okay! <laughs> I just wanna be okay, be okay, be okay I just wanna